What's going on? My name is Dan. I'm an amateur woodworker. This is my shop. And today I'm going to be making these saddles that go over the arm of a couch or a chair so that you don't have to drop that really hot coffee into your lap. Let's get to it. So this project's really for the person who sets their coffee perilously on the edge of an armchair. And to prevent it from falling on you or those near you, this saddle works really well. It'll adhere to the couch and you can specialize it to just your size because it's such an easy project. And look, it can hold coffee. It could hold a bottle of ragu in case you want to drink some spaghetti sauce, or if you're crazy, you could put a whole bucket of paint on there and that would be dandy. So at this point you've seen just glue up there, which is pretty simple. And I thought I'd talk just a second about what this project's gonna look like. Now this could be great for anyone's room that's kind of small, or let's say you don't have a coffee table because you hate coffee and don't wanna give it a whole table, or you have any other reason why you just need to kind of sit back, relax, be able to have your drink right on that sidearm and not have to set it there and hope it doesn't wobble off fall and ruin your relationship. So make sure that you think through the dimensions. And in this case, you wanna make sure that those dimensions are wide enough between the partition and that end partition that they fit snugly over the couch arm, but not too wide that they could tip or jostle. And then what's the point of this? You might as well just throw your coffee on the floor and see what happens. See how that goes with your relationship. Probably not good. Thank you. 
wraps up the saddle build. It's a really easy, accessible project, especially for an amateur or hobbyist woodworker. There's some simple cuts to this 145 degree, and then you're gonna be working with a groove here to make sure that you can get that piece wedged in at just the right distance for you. And if you have any questions or any comments, feel free to leave them below, and we'll see you next time.